Hello everybody, this is DreamGamer back for another Jurassic World Evolution mod showcase. And yes, it's churning them out now, aren't I? Because I've been a busy boy. Because I've been a busy boy. And we've got four more beauties for you for you to see. And yes, they're all they're all Earth dinosaurs because we I've actually I've I i do not think I've ever done an Anghylosaur before. Off the top of my head, I don't remember doing one. Well, I was work. Oh yeah, that's right. I was working on um, the Soropelta before Christmas, but then obviously I lost all my mods, including Soropelta, so that was basically scrapped. But no, no, enough about that. We got plenty of stuff to go through here. But before we, um... actually, yeah, let's just get started. Let's get started. Uh, what should we release first? Okay, we'll say we'll do Notosaurus first. So, ladies and gentlemen. A Nodosaurus. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Dinosaur King Nodosaurus. And yes, this one was quite an awkward one, as most of these Ankylosaurs are awkward because, you know, the, the model isn't exactly the same as the dinosaur king one obviously as you can see here by this by the flattened spikes i had to flatten these spikes because they were much more pronounced and obviously the dinosaur king notosaurus doesn't have any proper spike spikes i mean they just have knobbly bits like uh like these i mean hell even the name notosaurus means knobbed lizard so yeah it's a little bit awkward and oh um i hope that's just the animation yeah it looks like it's just the animation but yeah, Nodosaurus looks pretty good. It did a pretty good job on it. You know, it's not going to be perfect. You know, it's never going to be... You should take, you should accept that none of these mods are going to be perfect, perfect. But, you know, they are close representations of the Dinosaur King counterparts. And uh, the Ankylosaurs in particular are going to look a little bit different because that's, how, just, that's just how they are. And Nodosaurus in particular because, obviously, as I said, the Dinosaur King one doesn't have these things. And well, I don't. I I should really figure out how to remove these, but maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. You'll just have to see. But yeah. Anyway, that is Nodosaurus. Okay, we shall release the Polacanthus next, an oddity of the Ankylosaur world. Yes, this is a polar canvas, ladies and gentlemen. As I said, quite a colourful, a colourful one of the Dinosaur King world. And yes, again, like the Nodosaurus, a little model manipulation had to be done here. But I think this one turned out definitely better than the Nodosaurus. And you can't really see the... Well, you can if you, you zoom in, but you can't really see it as well. And yes, I added some spikes on the tail here. Spikes aren't really my specialty, but I do my best. And yes, I, I, I quite like this one, actually. I'm quite happy with how it turned out. I mean, it's a little bit scaly, but, you know, it's a reptile at the end of the day, isn't it? And yeah, not much to say here. That is Nogus. No, Polar Canvas. And well, we'll save that one for last, because that one's a special one. All right, up third, we have an Ankylosaurus. You know what's interesting about this guy is that the Dinosaur King model, I think, is the only one that doesn't actually have spikes on his body. It's more like flattened, kind of like the Nodosaurus, but yes, this is my Ankylosaurus mod. And it's kind of like a chocolatey poop mod because of all the browns and such. And yeah, you can see here, I added the brown texture stripes. The spikes are flattened. And again, you can't see them as much as you did on the Nodosaurus. I mean, you can if you look at this side, but... You know, a little bit pronounced there. But you know, like I said, it's not going to be perfect, is it? But yeah, that is Ankylosaurus. And I think I did, I did a pretty good job on it. Alright, last but not least, the one that I actually made into a new species. And I think this is actually the first new Ankylosaur mod in the whole community. Not that I put it on the Nexus, yet. 
But I, I will put it on the Nexus eventually. But yeah, this one's an... I think, yeah, as I said, it is the very first, like, Ankylosaurid new species mod. And it is the Cychania. Oh, lovely. Oh, <laughs> Yes, we have the Cychania, a proper one. And yeah, well, you can I'm sure you can see the first issue I have is the spikes on the side belly here go kind of through the leg. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> well, there's a dead car as well. Yeah, first issue I have is the uh, was the spikes going through the legs. I mean, come on, is this really evolutionarily efficient? You're running and you're basically impaling your legs and you go ah 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 when you run. <laughs> and oh yeah, it's in case you're wondering, and oh, the Indominus Rex died. Yeah, in case you're wondering, I, I was doing a test battle royale the other day. Because I planned to do a battle royale after this session. With all my new Dinosaur King mods, plus a bunch of other mods and such. And I've also um, balanced out the stats as well. So I've changed the stats of pretty much everything. So I'll just show you Stegoceratops, for example. And yeah, you could see I gave it a hell of a lot more attack and a little bit less defense. Because it should have that. So yeah, hopefully, and yeah, it's, I think it's turned out pretty well. You know, if it looks a bit, looks a bit balanced and decent. But anyway, enough about that. This is about this mod showcase, and well, there's not much else to showcase to be honest. Uh, I'll tell you what, we'll release some carnivores into the ring and see how they fare against my herbivore friends. Oh, hang on. Oh, we got a fight between Megalosaurus and Ankylosaurus. Whoa, look at that. Ankylosaurus getting a hit. And yes, I buffed this bad boy. Not too much, but I did buff it a little bit. And as you can see there, yep, he getting off another hit there. Go on, Ankylosaurus. Show him what that mole attack can do. Du -du 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 -dum. Oh, oh, I think he's dead. Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, the poor Ankylosaur squished by the gigantic fall as it attempted its mole attack. Oh, <laughs> it like twitched. Ooh, Mapusaurus taking on... <coughs> Sorry about that. Nah, Mapusaurus taking on Nodosaurus. Ooh, well, I don't know if... Well, Nodosaurus doesn't have any signature moves, so... Um... I tell you what, it can have Giga Rock Hammer. Can that Giga Rock Hammer defeat the heat eruption? The answer to that is no. Oh, bless him. <laughs> oh, it's so, so sad. He's like, no. You happy, pal? You just killed a defenseless Nodosaur. No, you're not supposed to fight each other. Ooh, this could be interesting, though. Which Magma Blaster was stronger? Oh, Torvasaurus's was stronger. Interesting. That'd be an interesting fight, because they both use Magma Blaster. But, don't worry about that, because... Oh, we don't want you to see that one. That's a mod I've done, and I haven't shown anyone yet. Well, I've posted it on um, Discord, but that's about it. But don't worry, because here come the cavalry. Buffed up Cychania and buffed up Ankylosaurus. And we might as well buff up the other two, but we're not going to, because I want to see Cychania and Ankylosaurus get killed. And while we wait, I might as well show you what I have planned for the next mod showcase, which won't be for a while yet, because I said, after this, we're going to do a battle royale. But we're not going to have just Dinosaur King dinosaurs, we're going to have all the dinosaurs I got. And other creature guys as well. Oh, that's kind of spoilery. But yeah. In this mod showcase, in the next one, we will have the Gojirasaurus. The Lillian Sternus, the Kentrosaurus, and the Stegosaurus. That's what we have planned. That's what I have planned for next week. And there may also be another Dinosaur King hybrid. And just if you thought Mega Faganax was fearsome, wait till you see what I got planned next. 
It's going to sh send shivers down your spine. Oh, bother. That's a clue, isn't it? Actually, no, no, it's not a clue. It's not a clue. But really, really, to you two, are, are, we, are we just having a fight to see which magma blaster is stronger? I mean, you're supposed to be fighting the herbivores. But it's a cool test. See which magma blaster is stronger. Which one has the stronger magma blaster? Not a clue. Oh, come on, guys. You're supposed to fight the herbivores, not each other. Oh, wow. The Torvosaurus actually won. What are your stats? 95 for 44, 112 to 26, so that's 138 play in, wait no, 138 play in, 139? Yeah, 139, so yeah, Torvosaurus is slightly stronger than Sorophaganax. Hmm, should nerf that, <laughs> but I won't. Who won here? Oh, the Macrosaurus won. That means we need a new Megalosaurus. Alright, I think that's enough for this session, so I hope you enjoyed. A little bit of a shame we couldn't get some of the carnivores to fight over bubbles, but I ran out of patience. But, yep, stay tuned for next time. For, as I said before, we got, well, we're going to do a battle royale first, but we got all these bad boys to showcase. And, until then, this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.